the next trick we're going to go over is the 5 -0. So the 5-0 is pretty much one of my favorite tricks. So it's gotta be your guys' favorite trick too. So before you start to learn the 5-0, you have to have your balance down in doing manuals. So definitely make sure that you're good at balancing in manual because it's literally the same balance. You're gonna go from manualing on top like this to grinding in 5-0 on the side like that. But you see the position of the board doesn't change and neither does your balance. So if you have your balance down in manuals, you can get your balance down in 5.0s. As long as you're waxing the ledge and it's not too sticky and all that good stuff. So before you get into the 5.0, you gotta have your 50-50s really down. So the 5.0 is kind of the next gradient from 50-50 after maybe you've learned some tricks out of the 50-50. So you're gonna approach the ledge at a slight angle with your feet in the normal ollie position. You're gonna pop the back of the board, slide your foot up, and then you're gonna put it into this position right here, slamming your wheels up against the side of the ledge, and that's the position you want your wheels in, just like that. And then you're going to hold that position as well as you can, grind across, and then when you're ready to come off, you're just gonna pop the tail and then ollie off to the side a little bit. Normally when you first learn this trick, you wanna do it off the end of a ledge. So you don't have to pop out, but you can just slide off. But today I'm gonna to show you with the 5-0 pop out because it's a little sicker anyways. All right, cool. Some things to know about the 5-0 is that there's two ways to do it. You can actually grind the 5-0 with your tail in contact with the ledge all the way down, just like that. So you can do a 5-0 like that. But once you get really good at it, and once you're trying to start to learn tricks out of the 5-0, you're gonna wanna have your tail balanced so it's not scraping on the ledge, so it's like that. So that's the one that you wanna be in just like that. But you can grind this trick like that. Some things that can go wrong with the 5-0 are, you can pop in and be leaning too far back like this. And if you do that, your board is gonna fly out, and then you're gonna fly back and fall. Or, you're too far forward, and you can either stick and fall forward, or just drop your board into 50-50, and then you're doing a 50-50. So you gotta have it balanced between this and too far back. You gotta be right in the middle, right in the sweet spot. So that's basically all there is to the 5-0. I hope you guys have fun learning this trick. You're gonna approach the ledge at a slight angle with your feet in the normal ollie position. You're gonna pop the back of the board, slide your foot up, and then you're gonna put it into this position right here, slamming your wheels up against the side of the ledge, and that's the position you want your wheels in, just like that. And then you're going to hold that position as well as you can, grind across, and then when you're ready to come off, you're just gonna pop the tail and then ollie off to the side a little bit. Normally when you first learn this trick, you wanna do it off the end of a ledge. So you don't have to pop out, but you can just slide off. But today I'm gonna to show you with the 5-0 pop out because it's a little sicker anyways. So that's basically all there is to the 5-0. I hope you guys have fun learning this trick. If you guys want to master your ledge skating, you have to check out Skateboarding Made Simple Volume 3. It's over an hour long, it's extremely detailed, and it covers every single one of these tricks. 
I break down each trick into its very smallest parts so you're never going to get stuck on a trick or stop progressing. So if you want to master ledge skating, you have to master the basics and then from there you can learn tricks in and out of the basic ledge tricks. So definitely check out Skateboarding Made Simple Volume 3 Grinds and Slides. Thanks for watching and have fun skating.